It's Bonnie. Happy Friday night. I am back. I wasn't going to do another video tonight, but you know what? It's St. Patrick's Day. Uh, let's have some fun. So the inspiration for this video was that I went down into the vault downstairs, all my candles, and I was putting something away, and I happened to see out of the corner of my eye my original pink petal tea cake, which, by the way, is not burned. Um... And I got to thinking, I'm like, you know what? I should pull some obscure candles that I think would make a good body care. So that was the inspiration uh, for this video tonight. So uh, yeah, Pink Petal Tea Cake. Is it the brand new Sweet Petal Pound Cake? Is it? We don't know. Um, Sweet Petal Pound Cake is actually um, Candied Rose, Raspberry Swirl, and Frosted Bundt Cake. Um, pink petal tea cake, though, is pink rose petals, pound cake, and vanilla glaze. No raspberry in this one. So I'm not sure. You never know. Because Bath and Body Works sometimes on their scent notes is a little off. It could be pink petal tea cake in a bottle, which I'm all for. Or could have a little bit of a raspberry note in there, which I'm all for, too. Um, the iced lemon pound cake, we all are like, is it bright lemon snowdrop? Um, I don't know. Um, I did see, and I knew this before, I forgot to mention this in the last video, I did see the scent notes. Uh, sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake. My guess is that it's probably Bright Lemon Snowdrop, which I'm so excited for because you know I've been asking for that for like three years now. <laughs> so I cannot wait until my package arrives. So that will be exciting. So Another lemon that I think would make an excellent body care is the lemon lavender shortbread. I love this one. This would make a really good relaxing aromatherapy body care. Uh, this is uh, sugared shortbread, zested lemon, fresh lavender sprinkles. It's like lemon for uh, to put you to sleep in the evening. This would make a really nice aromatherapy. So yeah, just putting that out there. This would make a great body care. Um, next up. Uh, pineapple crumb cake. Oh my goodness, you guys. This would make a really good body care. It's foodie. It's wonderful. I'm thinking for fall. Um, this one is golden pineapple, rich pound cake, and sweet brown batter. I would totally wear this. I love my pineapple, but wearing a pineapple crumble? Yeah, this would be so nice. It's a bubble bath a shower gel. I think this is like my number one next request <laughs> for a body care. I'm like, we got to have this in a body care. This, this is a great candle and a great body care. I think a really good men's scent. Um, so I'm trying to think like different. I'm like obscure. Remember Boathouse Row? I gave that a smell and I'm like, this does kind of smell like mahogany coconut a little bit. And I'm like, maybe it is. And I just can't figure this out. It says, originally launched in 2013. Enjoy a Bath and Body Works favorite of green sage, fresh pomegranate, and notes of bay leaves and moss. And I was just like, you know what? I think this would make a, a really nice men's collection. I'm like, yeah, Boathouse Row. And I think the packaging would be great, like a nautical men's collection. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, all, I'm all aboard that. That's obscure. Uh, next up. Uh tropical banana. Remember tropical banana? This one is fresh banana, creamy vanilla with a hint of tropical coconut. This would make the most wonderful body care. Oh my gosh. I love this candle. Um, and it would. We need a tropical banana body care next year. We have to have it. A little coconut milk. Um, you can put a little pineapple in there. I don't care. You know, as long as it's dominantly uh, banana. Oh yeah. I'm laughing. Does anyone want to wear candied maple bacon? I don't know. A lot of can a lot of uh, body care companies have fooled around with like um, bacon lip gloss. I can't decide if I want this as a body care, but I brought it up because um, these are the limited edition that I kind of feel like is the continuation of like the ice cream candle is the continuation of this because there's a little che check mark on here that says new in vault. So they're doing it again with the ice cream, but I can't decide. Does anyone want an obscure bacon maple body care? Do we want to smell like bacon, like a shower gel? I can't decide. I think it would make kind of a nice men's collection. I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, I got a couple more for you. I pulled a couple more. Okay. Um, Angel Food Cupcake. So, a lot of people call this the Play-Doh Sun, and I kind of get it. Uh, this one is White Cake Madagascar Vanilla and Cherry Whipped Cream. I love a good Madagascar Vanilla. So, I like this one. I like the white cake. I like the cherry whipped cream. I think this would actually, believe it or not, make an amazing body care. I think almost a better body care than a candle. Because like I said, I don't know why people thought this. By the way, it hasn't been burned. Um, I love this one. Like I said, some people got Play-Doh. But actually having a cakey vanilla cherry in a body care, yeah. That would be wonderful. Okay, so that's that's my next request. Um, cereal and cartoons. Wouldn't this make a cool body care, you guys? Uh, this is toasted cinnamon, crunchy cereal, ice cold milk, and sugar crystals. I would love to smell like cereal. I, <laughs> it's funny because sweet cinnamon pumpkin is always too cinnamony a little bit to wear a lot. But I'm like, man, if you added that like toasty crunch to it. I don't know. I think this would make a good body care. I think a lot of people would wear this. And I would love it as a shower gel. I don't know. I think this would make a good body care. Okay, next up. Hot fudge sundae. I totally want to smell like a hot fudge sundae this summer. Um, gooey fudge, vanilla bean, ice cream, and whipped cream. Again, this goes with the hot cocoa and cream. We have not seen hot cocoa and cream back. This is a little bit more like chocolate fudgy uh, than hot cocoa and cream. But I would totally wear this. I would totally wear a full-on chocolate ice cream body care. You know I would. Um, vanilla cola candy. I talked about this one the other day. I think this would make one of the best body cares. Seriously. I wish they would do a soda body care collection. Um, this is the fizzy uh, soda crystal sparkling sugar cane and creamy vanilla. I would totally wear this. I love the bubbly... I love the cola. I love the candle. A candle. <laughs> I love the candy. <laughs> I got candles on the brain here. I love the candy. Oh my gosh. I could smell this one all day, by the way. I love this one. I wish this candle would come back, but I would totally be on board with this with a body care. Um, I don't know if they could duplicate the scent in a body care, though. I think it would be neat, though, to spray this on. <laughs> Okay, I've talked about this candle before, and you know me, I don't always love peach. Peach and I don't always get along, but one of the best peach candles Bath & Body Works has ever done is called Peach Sugar Cone. Um, this one is Juicy Peach, Whipped Praline, and Crunchy Sugared Cone. I think it's the Whipped Praline, you guys. It smells so good. So, you know Berry Waffle Cone and I don't get along in the body care. Um, it's too, like... I don't know. There's just a note in it that's like kind of sour, kind of ugh. I don't know. I just don't like Berry Waffle Cone as much in the body care. I've said this before a lot. I love the peach sugar cone. There's like a note in here that's so delicious. Oh my gosh. And it's funny because the peach isn't like a ripe, gooey peach. It's like a um, very light peach and it works with the sugar cone and the praline. Honestly, I think this would make one of the best body cares, like, ever. Like, people would be, like, lined up to get this. Seriously, it would make a good one. Okay, I'm off my kick now. <laughs> Peach sugar cone. Okay, and then the final one. This is actually kind of a joke. It should be April Fool's Day. <laughs> Does anyone think we could do a pizza? A pizza body care? Do you want to smell like oregano? I've often thought about that, honestly. Like, <laughs> it's so weird. I'm like, does anyone want to smell like an herb? Um, fresh garden basil, tomato sauce from crusty pizza. <laughs> this is the weirdest candle from Bath and Body Works, the Rome pizza candle. But I've kind of wondered because oftentimes, like, um, you know, oregano isn't really like a perfume. But I'm I was kind of thinking, like, it's I'm half joking, you guys. But I just happened to see my pizza candle on the shelf, and I'm like. Would anyone wear that? Would I wear that? You know, <laughs> maybe during the Twilight years, you know, when Twilight Edward books were popular. <laughs> but I'm like, I don't know. I don't know, Mom. Would you wear a candle that smells like pizza? I mean, a body care? Would you wear 
a, a scent that smells like pizza? Uh, I like the smell of oregano. <laughs> See? I know! I'm like, I don't know. That could be a thing. See? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Would we want to smell like pizza, like walking down the street? Or a shower gel? I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> anyway, I kind of brought this one out as a joke. But I'm like, hmm. It does smell good, though. Anyway, oh my gosh, you guys. I just kind of, like, threw these together because I thought it would be fun. And then I was, as I was looking at them, I'm like, you know what? These are make really good body care. And I picked some obscure ones. Thank you, as always, for watching. It's always fun to hang out with you guys. I love reading comments. Um, let me know your favorite obscure candle that you'd like made into a body care. And maybe it is oregano. I don't even know. Anyway, <laughs> happy St. Patrick's Day. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.